So we got out of the van, and the first time we'd been in this place, and, uh, and I'm looking ahead, and it's just this really beautiful, just the scene, everything was really beautiful. And I say something about, you know, what a beautiful place this is, and I turn around, and my wife, she's crying. <laughs> and then I just realized, whoa, I think it's beautiful, but look what it's doing to her. Uh, and I, I envy that, and I knew that I'm dull. it's in the nature of love uh, to care for, for someone. Um, that love is not limited to people. I think we can also uh, love uh, creation. We can love what God loves. For myself, there's been a growing desire to look more closely at creation in order to understand God better. I see this very much as uh, worship leadership. We need other people besides musicians and poets to lead us in worship. We need naturalists, we need ornithologists, we need uh, biologists to open our eyes to creation, open our eyes to the glory of God, the genius of God, the love of God, the provision of God. Everything is created for the sake of something else. Uh, so, so this interconnection that, that something in creation is actually uh, has its own life, but its own life benefits something around it. As uh, Paul says in Romans, that God's invisible qualities are made manifest by what has been created. Creation doesn't have to be beautiful. <laughs> it could just be functional. But it is also beautiful, incredibly beautiful. As C.S. Lewis says, when we see something beautiful, we, we, we don't just want to see it. We want, we want to go into it. We want it to become part of us. There's a sense of, of our belonging somehow to beauty. There's a fair translation of the, the Greek word that we translate perfect when we read that Jesus says, be ye perfect as your Father in heaven is, that can be translated, be ye beautiful as your Father in heaven is beautiful. Most of us sense that we're out of touch with creation. We go for a walk in the woods or go on holidays and we just know right away, ah, oh, I've been missing this. This is an important part of my humanity.